at the demand side. So we are going to create a new column and the column will be labeled as dummy and the 30 will be filled with that column. And this is what we have. Do not forget, this is a prototype. You'll be given your problem, the unit cost. This is going to be a real value, a whole number, a value that is of value, value that is uh, realistic based on experience, based on past data the company has gathered or that is available. So on the concept of balancing on balance transportation model, it means you ensure that you're able to create a domain. And you can see we created a domain here and we put 30. And now you can observe that the total demand will be 170 because we have been able to fill up the gap of that 30. And you can see 50, 60, 30, which is 140. 140 plus 30 will give us 170. And this is already 170. And now we have a balanced transportation model. More importantly, do not forget, whenever you introduce a dummy, either dummy roll or dummy column, your unit cost will be zero. Take note, your unit cost will be zero, is zero unit cost. Whenever you introduce a dummy roll or dummy column, you're going to have a zero unit cost. While other parts have the original given unit cost. So this is how to make unbalanced transportation problem a balanced one. Now, let's look at what are the phases of solution in transportation model. We have two phases of solutions. Initial basic feasible solution, IBFS, and optimality test. Under each of these phases, we have methods. Under initial basic feasible solutions, we have the northwest corner rule, we have the least cost method, and we have Virgil approximation method. And the initial basic feasible solution is going to be the first phase you have to deal with whenever you are trying to solve a transportation problem or model. That should be the first phase. You cannot go to optimality test without passing through. In fact, one of the criteria of using the optimality test is that you should have obtained an initial basic feasible solution. So for the optimality test, we have the stepping stone and we have the modified distribution method. I hope you've learned one or two things in this video. If you're watching this video for the first time, watching this channel for the first time, kindly press like, press the subscribe button and do not forget to turn on the notification bell so that you can get a notification signal whenever I upload new videos. Thank you for watching. See you the next time. Bye for now.